In a world full of women that love to lie, take advantage of men, and most importantly, abuse their own powers, I, Dr. Bolo, am here today to be the light shining at the end of the tunnel with nothing but the truth to lead you down the path of righteousness. All right, what is going on everyone and welcome back to another video today fellas things have really gotten out of hand this week you might already know what i'm talking about but if you don't basically only fans models have started creating fake news articles with fake headlines on them in order to gain some publicity in hopes that they go viral today we're going to be talking about one model in particular but i want to mention this has happened to me multiple times already in fact earlier this week i sat down to record a commentary about a news article that i found on an OnlyFans model and turns out the entire news article was fake so i had to find something new to make a video about anyways before before we dive into the exposing, one thing I would like to briefly mention here, I will throw some visual evidence up on the screen alright fellas, but I'm not going to be dropping her name. Clearly she created these articles in order to gain publicity and well, I would just be a hypocrite if I'm exposing someone and at the same time giving them what they want. It just doesn't work like that man. Also, I guess I should mention that these articles we're looking at today is just as real as the core I'm going to be giving away, ladies and gentlemen. All you have to do is leave a like and subscribe to the channel, and you could be entered into getting a completely free car, all expenses paid, on me. And with all that being said, let's get into it here, fellas. So starting off here, we have an article that was posted on CNN Entertainment by Michael Porter. The first red flag in this scenario here is that CNN actually has a web page that looks like this. You can go on there and find any sort of journalist or staff member of CNN. Michael Porter does not exist there, okay? Michael Porter actually is a basketball player. It could be a coincidence that she chose this name, but it's also really fishy that Michael doesn't work at CNN. Red flag number two was look at the title of this article, all right? High school teacher in all capital fired after going viral on OnlyFans with student. This is not an article title. This is a YouTube title. Most journalists at least have enough self-dignity and respect for themselves not to title stuff like this. And lastly, I would like for you guys to pay attention to the fact that this was posted September 25th, 2020. And just take a brief look at the description down there. Former Covington Catholic High School teacher. That's about all we need to know at this point. Let's go on to the other articles I have here. Starting on the left here she actually screenshotted the article and uploaded it to her twitter account let it be known he was a former student with the dead emoji however if you look at the title it's the same exact title right again posted by cnn entertainment but this time it's by amy lee so supposedly two co-workers did not talk to each other and amy lee who also is not on the staff list at cnn supposedly posted the exact same article five days later all right guys now let's go ahead and move over to the article on the right a couple things to take note of here number one the title is the exact same as always so far this one's written by amy lee again who does not work at cnn the time it was last updated is the exact same as the article on the left however you'll notice that the pictures used in the article are different and if you look right below the pictures, you'll see the former Covington Catholic High School teacher. Oh, wait, that's that's Michael's work, though. Amy, how how'd you what? This, this doesn't make any sense, man. Oh, Dr. Bobo, you know that this is just a coincidence and you're just wrong. First off, go fuck yourself, unicorn. And for those of you guys that still aren't convinced, I did a Google search with her exact name in the title, OnlyFans Afterward, and then the title of the article, which has been consistent along three articles we've seen so far. Put that in Google, and the first thing that pops up is an iFunny post. Second thing that pops up is a Twitter account. 
you go to cnn entertainment it is not there within the search engine at this point if you do not believe that these articles have been faked you are so fucking dumb it actually hurts me i just want you to know that it's actually gonna hurt me i believe that i can now firmly state these females are indeed lying if you guys don't mind i'm just gonna go ahead and write a quick prescription here dr bolo perfect this bitch has been prescribed a hoe also it's bad enough to be caught in 4k but damn bro we got this bitch in 65,535k. at the end of the day fellas i understand that these females they're just out here bro trying to make some fucking money like i get it i really do okay but like at least have enough self-respect okay i know that's already at the bottom of the barrel with the pictures you're posting of yourself online but at least have enough self-respect to not fake these articles that anyone with a goddamn brain can decipher and know it's so clearly fake and staged i mean rather than wasting all this time and energy creating these fake articles dude wouldn't you rather just take a couple minutes out of your day and make a bait post on twitter like this would you kick me in the head for a million another thing to notice that's actually really funny is in this picture i previously posted up on your screen at the bottom left she says quit asking for the video when it's literally on my only fans for three dollars she's talking about the time that she supposedly posted a adult film with a student right again this is all 100 percent staged but when you actually go to her only fans she claims it's just three dollars right three dollars and you can watch the video um that's actually locked behind another 35 dollar paywall honestly dude you just can't make this shit up at this point Anyways, guys, Detective Baloney's work here, I can finally say, is done. However, if you guys want to stick around for a minute, I have a couple of funny comments I can show off here. This guy says, Wish I was in school, still never had teachers like this one. You're one hot milf I would love to spank. Damn, very beautiful too. I mean, that was a nice comment, right? You know, if I got a comment and some dude's like, Damn, you're one hot dilf. I want to spank your ass. I'd be like, damn bro there's a dude out there that actually wants to spank my ass like damn and then you have dudes on the opposite end of the spectrum that are saying how about you literally give it to me for free moron i know we've already seen a lot of dumb shit within this video but trying to bully an OnlyFans model on Twitter into giving you her nudes for free when they're already $3? Damn, bro, that, that's literally an all-time low. I mean, this guy, this guy for crying out loud hasn't even been down that goddamn bad. Anyways, guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new. Leave a like if you enjoy the content, and I will catch you guys next time. Later.